What up, YouTube? What's going on? How y'all doing today? It is Taco or Daniel, and we're here to bring my very first game news. We're gonna talk about games, and game releases, consoles, everything like that of the source, and what's upcoming throughout the years. And uh, today, I'm gonna do a video, pretty much talking about the Nintendo NX, aka the Switch. There's a commercial for it. It just came out yesterday, and it looks beautiful. I swear to you, it is probably the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. And I can already see that there's going to be color blotches and different things all together from it. But that's besides the point. The first thing we're going to talk about for that console is the fact that it does cartridges again. It's bringing back the old cartridges just like it used to do for, of course, the 3DS and stuff. As well as for, you know, the 64. So, I like that there's going to be so much power in a little cartridge. There was also an another thing I saw throughout the video, uh, throughout the uh, commercial, which I'll put in the description below. There's a set of images that I'm going to post right here as well, where you can see multiple different games. Although Bethesda has said that they don't know about uh, if they're going to put in development a Skyrim that they showed, but by, by pressure, hopefully they will. Either way, it doesn't matter to me because I'm going to get the console regardless. Um, this shows another Mario Kart. It looks like Double Dash. I'm not sure which one it is, but it looks like it's gonna be an update, of course, because King Boo's in it, and he's never been in the Mario Kart yet. So I'm like, I'm size, I'm ready. My body is ready. It's, it's, it's ready. Enough of that. Um, another thing I saw was um, that, of course, Zelda: Breath of the Wild has three trailers, uh, gameplay trailers out right now, and again, that game is freaking beautiful. It's it's gonna be one of the, probably gonna be the best one. Who knows? We'll see. And of course, this is another Mario platformer. I know that in there it shows two images of Mario where he's running and the screen is behind him. Of course, in third person. But at the same time, what is it? Because obviously it's a new game, but we don't know what kind of Mario it is. So whether it's like an old school Mario 64 type of thing, or it's like a Galaxy type of thing. But who knows? We'll see when they uh, give us more information about it. But for right now. There's an image for it, and it's gonna hold on till its release date. Speaking of release date, it comes out on March next year. That's how close that is, man. It's literally just like five months at most, like six months. It's literally half a year. It's coming so soon, so close, man. And I know, I know you can't wait for it as well. I know I can't wait for it. One of the other things I want to talk about for this console is the controller. Not just like the actual slide up, slide down controller, which I'll put over here as well, but the actual like handheld controller separate from the console's main controller. Like you know how we had a controller, the we had a controller, the pros. This controller, it brings back the analog on the bottom. So it's no longer on top like the old Wii U Pro, which is weird as hell. That was kind of stupid. But now that the controller is back to normal, it's on top on the left side and bottom on the right side. So it's gonna be a nice feel. There's an image over here as well that you can see to check it out, and that it looks beautiful. Now let's talk about the handheld console. <laughs> handheld console, portable, deep. It's it's a, it's it's an all-in-one package. For the, we thought the Wii U was gonna be like this, where you can play it outside or anywhere. Unfortunately, it was a little bit lagging, uh, lacking in that department where you can only play it within five feet of the console without it losing connection or without it being completely working. But this time, they actually did it right. They got it right, where you can literally take the screen or slide the controllers off, slide it back on the controller inside of the monitor inside of the screen, take it with you, go somewhere else, and still play it while your console is back at home. You can literally take the screen, the tablet or whatever it is, and just go out. Just do your thing. You know how beautiful that is? You can be on a bus ride, a plane ride, a long meeting in class. You can go be anywhere as long as you just have the slide. I don't even know what the hell it's called, the slider, the switcher, or whatever the hell it's called. But it's 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 so amazing that this innovation is an upgrade from the Wii U, even though it's not linked to the Wii U or the 3DS, which is beautiful because we don't need a predecessor of those. We just needed something new, and this is that new thing. And not only is it new, but it's powerful. It's run and powered and backed by NVIDIA technology. Come on, how beautiful is that, man? I'll give you the specs as well in the description below so you don't have to worry about where are they at? I want to be a tech nerd, blah, blah, blah. You'll find that out. It's in the description below. We're going to we're gonna talk more about that later in another video or something like that. But for right now, this is all we know about it. I know I'm excited for it. Are you ready for it? Tell me what your you know what your expectations are, how you feel about it, and what you thought about it when you started the video. And uh, there, I think that's about it. Uh, if you enjoyed, let me see you uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share, bruh. And uh, don't forget, anything that's on your mind, let me know, and we'll talk about it.
Just keep on hitting this midget until I can get them out of the least and try to. This is ridiculous, man. God, that Teemo, man. And they're pushing fucking hard.